Hello and welcome back for another GRT price prediction update and in this video I'll be diving deep into the technical analysis and also give you my next price targets and before I do so show some love by first giving this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and also check out the channel membership and allow me to start the video by first giving you my long term point of view here on the GRT chart where you can see that we have been obeying the edu structures and after seeing our December lows we saw this massive bounce to the upside in a move that gave us a peak at around the 0.2325 dollar mark completing the formation of this larger edu count one then afterwards we started a breakdown move to the lower side in the formation of a larger edu count two where using the fibonacci's connecting them from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave one that gave me a minimum retracement area for that second wave between the fib level 0 0.5 and the fib level 0 0.78 which is an area that lies between the 0 0.1435 dollar mark and the 0 0.0926 dollar mark which is an area that we fully maximized and we had been breaking down in this abc corrective structure and since we have managed to fully maximize the target area for that second wave there are high chances that the low for this second wave is now in and now GRT is now ready for a massive pump to the upside in the formation of this larger edu wave count 3 and giving you minimum target areas for that third wave to the upside by connecting the trend based Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave 1 then dragging the fibs to the low of the second wave and that now gives me a minimum target area for that wave 3 at the fib level 1.618 and that is at around the 0 0.380608 dollar mark and that is the minimum that i'm expecting grt to do in the next bull market and in the formation of that wave 3 and for that move to also play out there are key moves that we need to keep our eyes on here on the grt chart and the first one is that we need to see a five wave move play out here on the charts followed by an abc corrective structure before we can continue gearing up suggesting that the low for this wave two has been confirmed to be in and that we have now started an impulsive move to the upside in the formation of this wave three and this is the move that i'm trying to look out and also track here on the grt chart on the lower time frames and so far i have not yet seen a valid additive structure though we are seeing that we still have the momentum to continue gearing up and this is all playing out after first breaking out out of this chart pattern that we had been trading within which is a triangle which gave us the breakout to the upper side and its minimum target areas at around the 0 0.1122 dollar mark we fully maximized and you can also see that at the time of this recording we are holding above the 20 day ma here on the one hour chart which is now acting as support for us to continue gearing up and there are chances that we might continue gearing up and the moment we see a break above this high that we made at around the 0 0.1143 dollar mark then we might continue gearing up in another impulsive move to the upside in a move that should take us above the 0 0.125 dollar mark and in case we continue in such a movement then soon i'm expecting grt to start printing on the charts a negative structure that we can uh, we can start tracking and maybe at some point we can get a nice five wave move to the upper side so for now let's be patient and see how that plays out and continue watching those key areas of supports and resistances because that is all we can base our analysis on at the moment until we get a valid additive structure on the charts also taking a look at the indicators on the rsi we are trading at around the 56 mark also taking a look at the macd we have been able to print a bullish cross fully supporting higher prices so let's be patient and see how that plays out and i'll be keeping you updated